What's up guys? So, I'm back in Arizona. I want to do a quick overview of my San Diego trip. The bay fishing was rough, didn't catch anything, which is weird because we normally have really good fishing. When I was little, we used to catch 80 fish, spotted bay bass, calico, halibut, sculpin, really all those bay fish that you could think of. I mean, just had phenomenal days when I was a kid. It slowly declined since they dredged Mission Bay. That was the worst fishing that I had. I couldn't even make a video out of it. It was it was just horrible. Went surf fishing yesterday and uh, caught three spot fin croaker, one decent perch. I had two other spot fin croaker hit, popped off. I saw a lot of corbs in the surf. I did see a lot of spot fin croaker as well. I kept mistaking the spot fin croaker for corbina, but that's that's just my mistake. I mean, Corbina are a lot, uh, are longer, a little more slender. And then I started paying attention when I was catching those fish. I was paying attention to the spot on their fin, hence the name Spot Fin Croaker. Um, uh, I had a lot of fun though. They fight like absolute crazy. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, please subscribe. And this is just a quick overview because I didn't get to do a intro, nor did I get to do an outro. So this is just a quick run through. Let's go check it out. Guys, I finally got a good fish. About time, yeah. It might be a cord. I finally got a good fish, guys. Unless it's just a decent sized perch, I was finally able to eat the bait. Oh my God, please stay on. Oh no, it's a corb. It is a corb. God, he's peeling drag. These things are so strong. Look at him, look at him. That's my biggest corb ever. Beautiful fish. Look at that fish, guys. Woohoo! I saw him, he ran up and he chased it right as the wave came in. Yeah. He hit it. What is that? Uh, it's a corbina. A what? A corbina. Oh, yeah? Yeah. They're like basically saltwater carp in a way. Oh, wow. In my opinion, that's what I see him as. So, will you eat it or are you going to throw oh, him no. out? Oh, no. I'm going to throw him out. I just want a picture and throw yeah, him back. He's a nice catch. Yeah. <laughs> there he goes. Yeah. Yeah, they're like ghosts. I can see them better in the evening. My, uh, real. It's full of sand. It's kind of messed up. The reel's gonna probably be thrashed after this. I've never gotten this reel this messed up. I've never had my uh, reel get this much sand and salt in it. So hot, a lot of hot water, try to clean it out the best that I can, oil it up, and uh, try to keep it, keep it functioning, keep it moving. Alright guys, hooked up again. I got a perch I believe and it feels like a decent one. Not too bad. I'm just letting my bait be drugged by the current. Yep, decent little perch. Let's get him on up. There he is. Little surf perch. They're fun to catch. This, this little guy was actually able to eat it so that's good. They will remind me of saltwater crappie. Let's get them back in. Got one, guys. I think it's another corp. Come on, stay down. Come on, come on, stay on, stay on, stay on. Oh, it's another corb, guys. It's another corb. I got another corb. Come 
on, stay on, stay on. Man, they fly like absolute crazy. Hey, he, he hit right away, right when I hit the water. Nice job. All right. Look at this cord, guys. Really pretty fish. Let's get, let's get the hook out. Awesome, guys. Let's get this fish back in. There he goes. Right back in. Yeah, right when, right when that bait hit the water, pretty much right away, you hit it. That's a good one. All right, guys, I hooked up again. Right as I was reeling in. Let's see. Oh. Oh, there's another. It's another. Yeah. This is the biggest one. All right. So, finally got another. Let's go grab my rod. Get another uh, little sand crab on. 